Welcome to Byte Further. Today's video is about how to fix iPhone security lockout. Maybe you suddenly open your iPhone in security lockout after update. Perhaps you forgot the passcode and kept entering the wrong passcode several times. Finally, you find that your iPhone says security lockout 15 minutes, 1 hour, or even no timer. Don't panic. We'll show you how to fix security lockout on iPhone. Previous to that, what does security lockout mean on an iPhone? Briefly, it's a function featured by iPhone running iOS 15.2 or later. When you see security lockout message on iPhone, it means that the wrong passcode has been entered too many times. Aside from that, the security lockout feature can be used to unlock your iPhone even if you've completely forgotten the lock screen passcode without using any computer. Alright, next. We'll show you how to unlock iPhone security lockout using three solutions. Note that all the methods here will erase all the data and content to unlock your iPhone. That's no way to fix security lockout iPhone without erasing data if you forgot the passcode. Though, the good news is that you can still get the data back if you have iCloud or computer backup for them. Now, let's start. If you've inserted a SIM card on your iPhone, signed in the device with Apple ID, and updated it to iOS 15.2 or newer versions, you'll see iPhone security lockout screen with an erase iPhone button on the bottom right of the screen after you enter the wrong passcode too many times. This is the new feature added by Apple to unlock iPhone when you forgot passcode without using a computer. Now, let me show you how to do that. The steps of how to fix security lockout on iPhone 7, 8, X, 11, 12, 13, or newer models are the same. Tap the erase iPhone button. You'll see the security lockout message again. Leave it alone and tap erase iPhone option again. Next, enter your Apple ID password correctly. A few seconds later, the erase process will begin. You'll see an Apple logo showing up along with a progress bar underneath. Just wait until the iPhone security lockout unlocking process ends and the device boots up to the hello screen. Now, follow up with the setup assistance to quickly set up your iPhone. If you have backups in iCloud or on the computer, you can restore data from them on the apps and data screen like this. When all is set up, your iPhone is successfully unlocked and you can use it as normal as before. Alright, the next solution to bypass iPhone security lockout times is to unlock with iTunes or Finder on your computer. This method is helpful if you don't see the erase button on the screen or it's not responding to touch, whatever the reason is. Now, let's start. Plug your phone into the computer with a USB cable and open iTunes or Finder software. Then, put your locked iPhone into recovery mode so that iTunes or Finder can successfully connect to your phone without any passcode being entered. Different iPhone models should follow different button press combinations to get into recovery mode. For iPhone 6s or earlier versions, press and hold both the home button and side button until you see the recovery mode screen like this. For iPhone 7 or iPhone 7 Plus, press and hold both the side button and volume down button until you see the recovery mode screen. For iPhone 8, X, XR, 11, 12, 13, or later models, quickly press the volume up button, the volume down button, and then hold the side button until you see the recovery mode screen. Now, just follow the steps that fit your own iPhone model to enter recovery mode. You can try a few times if you can't enter at once. Once done, go back to your computer and you'll see iTunes or Finder sending you a message with the update or restore button. The update doesn't work whether you see iPhone security lockout, iPhone unavailable, or other lock screen message. So, let's go with the restore button. Next, click restore and update. Keep following the on-screen steps. After that, iTunes or Finder will trigger downloading the iOS firmware, extracting it, and installing it into your locked iPhone for unlocking. When the erasing and unlocking process is done, your iPhone will boot up automatically to the hello screen. Quickly set it up and now, you manage to get your iPhone out of security lockout screen. The final solution is to reset iPhone security lockout screen using iCloud. This fix works as long as you have turned on Find My on your phone before it's stuck on security lockout screen. Remember the Apple ID account and password, and connect your phone to a solid internet. Now, let's start. Go to iCloud.com, and enter your Apple ID and password correctly to sign in. Remember to use the iCloud account you use to log into your unavailable iPhone. Enter the certification code. Now, click the Find iPhone icon. Then, click All Devices on the middle top of the screen. Here, 
Find your iPhone that says security lockout message and click it. Next, choose erase iPhone and select erase. Then, iCloud will start erasing all the data and settings on your phone and factory reset it. It'll take a few minutes to complete the process of erasing iPhone security lockout message. When you see the hello screen, just set it up and now you successfully turn off iPhone security lockout. That's all how to fix iPhone security lockout message. Hope this video helps you unlock the phone and bypass the lockout times message. If it does, please give it a thumbs up and share it via Facebook, Twitter, and so on to help others in need. Also, if you have any further questions, feel free to write them down in the comments below and I'll reply ASAP. To learn more tech tips about iPhones, subscribe to the Byte Further channel. Now, you can click another video on the screen to keep watching.